still following us? Yes. Is there one of them? Hmm? Is he looking at us? Hmm? Does he have just one hand on the steering wheel? Mm-hmm. When you hear something that sounds like a gunshot, drive. Done. We recently discovered the existence of an international criminal organization with ties to former Nazis. Rumor has it they built an atom bomb. We have no choice but to work together to infiltrate this organization. We'll leave you two to get acquainted. Napoleon Solo, the CIA's most effective agent. Ilya Kuriaki. KGB, the youngest man to join in their best within three years. America is teaming up with Russia. Things could get a little messy. The thing is, I work better alone. I work better alone too. Okay, I'll let you tag along. How did you get the invitation to my party? I stole it. So you're a thief. I hope you wear a mask. Sometimes. Just never when I'm stealing things. Not very good at this whole subtly thing, are you? It'll be like this for 20 minutes. Can't touch. Don't make me put you over my knee. So you want to wrestle? No, I did not say that. Shall we? Come on! Special agent, you're not having a very special day, are you? Do uh, these belong to you or to me? What a weird movie! It's like the funny accent movie. Everyone's like, let me try what I've always wanted to. Guy Rich is like, go ahead! You've got a funny accent from Henry Cavill. You've got a pretty good accent from Army Hammer. Uh, you have a funny accent from Jared Harris from Mad Men. You've got a funny accent from Hugh Grant. Uh, it's just... It's just a whole lot of weird, and I'm not quite sure if it's more Mordecai or more Kingsman the Secret Service. And speaking of Kingsman the Secret Service, I think the timing on the release of this trailer is very bad. Uh, I understand that they wanted to play in front of Kingsman the Secret Service because they feel it's a similar audience. If you like Kingsman, sure, you'll love the man from UNCLE, right? Well, here's the problem. Kingsman the Secret Service is so good and so unique that this just pales in comparison. Now, I realize a lot of you haven't seen Kings from the Secret Service because it, uh, it's just opening with this trailer, obviously. But I think once you do see that movie, you'll understand how this just comes up short. Uh, I am rooting for everybody in the film. I love everybody who's uh, showcased here. I would love to see Henry Cavill be able to build a persona outside of his role as Superman. I think Army Hammer is vastly underappreciated. He was great in The Lone Ranger. He's a really solid actor. Uh, I also think Jared Harris obviously is uh, pretty good. As I've said recently, he really burned me with the quiet ones. Uh, so I'm rooting for him, but just a little less enthusiastically these days. And Hugh Grant. I love seeing Hugh Grant being able to get more work. And I would love for him to be able to redefine himself at this stage in his career. But again, it's no Kingsman. And I just listed all the male characters. Uh, unfortunately, I feel that the women that Guy Ritchie has cast here are typical Guy Ritchie female casting. You know, uh, eye candy, uh, more concerned with them being hot than having a lot of personality. Uh, Alicia Vikander, I recently saw her in Seventh Son. I wasn't particularly impressed. Maybe she's a better dramatic actress, but I also think she just doesn't have the striking, fun, you know, almost... Uh, you know, highly stylized look, I guess you could say, of Henry Cavill and Army Hammer. I mean, they're both prettier and they've got more personality. So I think she's not a good match with them. Uh, and then also that blonde woman you see Henry Cavill talking to, she, uh, you've seen her before, she was the friend in The Great Gatsby. She's the one who said that I love, you know, crowded parties, they, they feel so intimate. She really did a great job in that movie. She had uh, a lot of scene-stealing lines, uh, and I wish that I saw the same kind of quality in her work here. I think she just hasn't been given the opportunity. Uh, so I know a lot of you were very excited about this trailer. I feel bad being a bit of a wet blanket. But trust me, I think you're excited about it.
because you haven't seen Kingsman the Secret Service. So I'm looking forward to hearing your comments down below. But then I would also ask you to potentially come back after you've seen Kingsman and weigh in on, as to which one uh, gets it right and if this can com possibly compete with Kingsman once you know what Kingsman is. All right, so thank you so much for tuning in to my review. Thank you everyone who asked me to review this trailer. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it when you see a trailer and you think of me. That means the world to me, uh, and I, I'm catching up on trailer reviews today, and you can watch uh, some of them right now.